the Aam Admi Party has uh, taken on the BJP, accusing it of trying to topple the Delhi government by hook or by crook. The BJP is using central investigating agencies as what uh, uh, the Aam Admi Party has alleged against uh, its leaders who are, according to the Aam Admi Party, getting calls from the BJP to switch sides. Five senior Aam Admi Party leaders have in a press conference today uh, hit out at the BJP for allegedly trying to lure the Aam Admi Party MLAs with cash or threatening them with CBI and ED uh, going after them. The Aam Admi Party national spokesperson and Rajya Sabha MP Sanjay Singh claimed that he would expose how the Prime Minister-led government is using central agencies to bring down the government in the national capital. Efforts are on to break the MLAs of Delhi and that has started is what uh, Sanjay Singh has alleged, adding that the BJP tried a shinde on Deputy Chief Minister of Delhi Manish Sisodia but the attempt failed. He claimed the BJP members threatened the Aam Admi Party MLAs. They say now that uh, an offer of 20 crore rupees is being made to Aam Admi Party MLAs to switch sides to the BJP and to break the Aam Admi Party. The BJP has completely denied these allegations. Let's quickly listen in to both the sides. हाय हमारे साथ ये हो गया हाय हमारी पार्टी को तोड़ा जा रहा है हाय हम हमारे पास ऑडियो है पर हम दिखाएंगे नहीं उप सुनाएंगे नहीं हम समय का इंतजार करेंगे ये सारी चीजें वो करेंगे वो ट्रेलर पे ट्रेलर ट्रेलर पे ट्रेलर फिल्म नहीं आ रही ट्रेलर पे ट्रेलर आ रहे हैं all right, Vedant is now joining us with more details. Vedant, uh, take us through uh, what the Aam Aadmi Party's specific allegations have been today. Uh, that's right, Maha. A bit of an explosive uh, press conference uh, by the Aam Aadmi Party. It was, of course, uh, led by uh, Raj Sabha MP uh, Sanjay Singh. But, uh, you know, four of AAP's MLAs today claimed that they were bribed by the Bharati Janta Party uh, to break away from the Aam Aadmi Party and join the BJP. Uh, of course, uh, MLAs uh, Somnath Bharti, uh, Sanjeev Jha, Ajay Dutt and Kuldeep Kumar uh, narrated uh, their anecdotes uh, saying that they were offered as many as rupees 20 crores uh, to join the BJP. Uh, they also said that once they refused uh, this offer, uh, they were threatened uh, by the BJP uh, saying that they will be slammed with ED and CBI cases uh, like they did with uh, uh, Manish Sasodia. And uh, they also claimed that they, these uh, BJP uh, leaders uh, who offered them money, according to them, were national level leaders and also a prominent West Delhi MLA uh, reached out to one of these MLAs, uh, one of these ARP MLAs, uh, saying, that, uh, you, they, saying that they will they will be slammed with ED and CBI cases if they don't join the BJP. Uh, so uh, they, one of the MLAs also claimed that uh, these uh, BJP leaders who reached out to them said that they are well aware that the cases against Manish Sisodia are fake and that he has been falsely framed in uh, the liquor policy scam. Uh, so these uh, bombshell claims by ARP MLAs today in the press conference and uh, they also said that there's a concerted effort by the BJP to bring down uh, the ARP uh, government in Delhi and that uh, many of these BJP leaders have been uh, you know, given the task to uh, reach out to these MLAs, uh, these ARP MLAs and these ARP MLAs also claimed uh, that the BJP told them, the BJP leaders told them that as many as 20 to 25 ARP MLAs are already in touch with uh, the BJP and uh, they will at any cost bring down the ARP government. That is what these MLAs claim today in the press conference. All right.